open. Hopefully by now you have cleaned the kitchen a little bit. Take out a chicken flavoring stock. The Federation recommends using stock that has been made from chickens where farmer does not torture them. Try to use free range Russian chicken stocks. Okay. Add the chicken stocks to the water. You can use boiling hot water to wash extra stock of fingers, but it will burn. Run hand under cold water. These are Russian brown lentils. Add them to the stock. No, don't. Don't add them to the stock. Take them out. You must add them to frying pan first. Take a small Russian stand of frying pan. Add one handful of brown Russian lentils. Add a small amount of Russian butter. And set bench top stoves to settings 8.25. Now the lentils are getting hot with cotton, leeks, and uh, onions. You can see this leak has standard Russian markings. This is a sign of an error. You must cut it out. The flat spot helps to stop leak rolling away off the bench top. This is custom trick. Try to pick up any scraps within three standard Russian seconds. Aha. While we have been working, butter has melted. Distribute brown lentils evenly and change heat on stove top cooker to 
must check very carefully the lentils do not burn. If spoon is not available, use a piece of leek to stir the lentils. Okay, these lentils are very hot. We add them now to the soup. Place small Russian frying pan back on it and change bench top stove power back to 8.25 and add leeks it could be that there is too many leeks for a rushing frying pan but it is not good to make too many dishes or wife gets angry so take half of leeks out when they are cooked we will put them in with the potatoes then we cook the other leeks and put him with the potatoes in the ration pot. When this is all done, I will get back to you.